Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your printer is not accepting print commands on your computer. So basically, this isn't really a printer issue. If you're experiencing printer problems, it's really not the kind of video for you. This is more on the Windows computer side, like if your print queue is messed up and it's not printing anything out. This tutorial will be for you. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the start menu and you want to type in printer. Best match should say printer and scanner on Windows 10. Older versions of Windows, you still want to go underneath printers or something along those lines. So I'm going to select my printer from this list over here on the right. And then I'm going to left go and open in queue. So you can see we have our printer status here. Any documents that be printing out would be listed in here. You want to left click on the printer tab and then you want to left click on cancel all documents. You're going to be prompted, are you sure you want to cancel all documents? You want to select yes. Once you've done that, you want to close out of these windows and open up the star menu again. Type in command prompt. Best match should say command prompt right above desktop app. You want to right click on that and then left click on run as administrator. Okay, and if you receive a user account control window, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? You want to select yes. Now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in net, so N-E-T, space, stop, another space, spooler, S-P-O-O-L-E-R. Then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. It should say the print spooler service was stopped successfully. Once you're done typing that in, I'm going to have a command in the description of the video. I want you to copy from the description and paste it into this command line window. All you have to do to paste it in is just go up to this top bar right here, right click on it, left click on edit, and then left click on paste. Once you paste that in, you want to hit enter on your keyboard. Now you want to close out of here. Open the start menu back up. Type in services. Best match should say services right above desktop app. You want to left click to open that up. Now you want to go down to get to print spooler right here. Right click on it. Left click on properties. You want to make sure the startup type is set to automatic. And if service status has stopped, you want to click on the start button right here. Once you're done doing that, click on OK. Close out of any open programs or windows you still have open on your screen. Restart your system as well as your printer, and hopefully your problem has been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.